idea is amazing. It has been stressful. I think it's time to have some fun. And so the idea here is team building in a relaxed environment. There's a little bit of education, there's some learning, but also just to have fun with friends. Our group had an amazing time. Uh, we had a group of seven that came in, a mix of pharmacists, ID physicians, um, so our whole team came together and it was challenging, but not overly challenging and extremely fun. And it was a great mix of science, puzzles, and just team building. It was super fun. You know, it was a great time to spend time with colleagues. You got to kind of dig into some mystery, dig into a little bit of drama, and it was a great time. It seems like it's been a big um, hit so far. You know, this is our first actual true run. We had a couple uh, test runs yesterday, but uh, we filled up our sign up within 15 minutes yesterday. Today our sign up's already full, so I think there's a lot of enthusiasm for this. One of the things we hope is that people will see that teaching can be gamified, that learning can be fun, and that we'll have people take this concept back to their own home institutions and pay it forward, more escape rooms, more games, and more fun learning ID. I think it's that like education and focus on the field of ID that makes it you know, really interesting. I know most of us are here because we love ID so much, and so getting to apply that to a fun situation like an escape room was definitely uh, well, a lot of fun, has that you know, lead up to that question implied. They did a really nice job combining a lot of different puzzles. So some puzzles that were microbiology based, some puzzles that were uh, physically based and you had to really investigate different things in the room. There was just a lot of different types of puzzles that blended together really nice to solve the ultimate prize. This one does a better job of blending education with entertainment. I feel like at most of the other escape rooms, they're trying to balance a story that might be like a horror story or a comedy or something. This is very, you know, science focused, infectious disease focused, but they tie it with fun. Um, I think people will be really impressed by what they see when they get in there. I think one of the greatest crimes is probably that the sign up list behind me is so short and there's, you know, only two rooms for people to go into. So something that I think a lot of people who come to the conference could have a lot of fun with and look forward to seeing how it hopefully continues to expand throughout the years.